I'm going to solve for x in this example and I'm going to illustrate how we can clear out our decimals to make the uh, algebraic process a little easier. Because it's algebra, I can do anything I want to one side of the equation so long as I do it to the other, including multiplying everything by 10. And that's going to have the effect of clearing out our decimals. 10 times 2.3 is just going to leave us with 23. So it's going to be 23x. And that's likewise going to be for all the other parts. By multiplying by everything by 10, I now have an equivalent equation. That means the same answer for x, but no longer involves decimals. Now I'm going to isolate x by adding 72 to each side. On the left side, that's going to cancel out and leave me simply with 23 times x. And on the right side, negative 3 plus 72 is the same thing as 72 minus 3, which is going to be 69. Finally, to isolate x, I can divide both sides by 23. 23 over 23 is 1, or simply 1 times x. Therefore, x is equal to 69 divided by 23, which very nicely comes out to 3. Of course, they're not always going to come out this easy, but my main point here was to illustrate this concept, that you can multiply everything by 10, or you can do it by 100 or 1,000, depending on whatever you need in order to clear the decimals, and that's just one thing less you have to worry about as you're solving the problem. Hope that helps. Thank you.